Nigerian car importers want the customs service to give them time to regularize their duty papers. They're speaking against the backdrop of recent rage and car stands by the customs officials for non-payment of duty. Lara Folayo reports. The customs quest to shore up Nigeria's non-oil revenue base informed its decision to clamp down on car stands in the FCT. Abuja-based car dealers say cars with import duties of more than 1.5 billion naira have so far been seized for want of duty papers. They say the actions of the customs officials have been bad for business and now seek a period of grace to pay outstanding dues. As a responsible organization, who will not in any way support any form of illegality, we are left with no other option than to once again seek the magnanimity of the Coronel General of Customs and its management team for another opportunity for all our members to submit all on duty vehicles in their car park for duty payment. Our plea is based on the reasoning that given the window, the palpable fear will be reduced, Nigerian Customs Service will generate more funds for the government well, our members' investment will be protected. These businessmen say government should make the automotive policy better work for the Nigerian economy. They also appeal for a reduction in duties paid on cars. The genesis of this whole crisis is the automotive policy, which has made custom duty and levies to be raised to a level where people felt sh shortchanged, all in an effort to make imported fairly used vehicles, popularly called Tukumbo, unaffordable in a bid to force people to patronize the so-called assembly Nigerian cars. We therefore call on the executives and the legislators to take a second look at the workability of this policy and bring down the amount of duty on imported vehicles as this is the only permanent solution to this issue. This will automatically encourage more people to pay their duty and equally make vehicles affordable to Nigerians. The Nigerian Customs Service earlier this year gave the owners of old cars as well as car dealers time to regularize their papers, an initiative that was later suspended. The Nigerian Customs Service already warned it will begin implementing provisions of its law on possession of smuggled items. The law provides that car dealers who trade in cars with unpaid duties risk a one-year jail term without an option of fine. Lara Folayo, TVC News, Abuja.